What's up guys? <laughs> What's up guys? My name is ICOT and uh, welcome back to Doki Doki Literature Club. I've pretty much been playing this game non-stop. I've probably forgotten about every single other game in my life and I've been playing this game non-stop because like I'm just so hooked into this game it's unreal absolutely unreal if you haven't left a like on this series then i have no idea where the heck you've even been because as best as i can tell this is probably the most popular uh game series on youtube right now or was kind of is still i'm not sure i've still got the game files you can't see them right now but i've still got the game files and just let's just load in so 1703 yeah i played this pretty much earlier on today so let's just go back in so Hi, I still tea. I've been waiting for you. Hang on a m Yuri. Hang on a m did we, did we have this before? Are you ready to continue reading? Sure. I brought my best tea today. Monica! Wait, wait Monica? Wait. Monica's not here though. Why is she calling out Monica? I told you not to. Ugh. Is she really late again? Of course she's late again. It's Monica, what do you expect now? Inconsiderate as usual, Natsuki. Excuse me? Must you always interrupt my conversations with your innocent yelling? What are you talking about? You say that like I do it on a regular basis or something. I, I, I just wasn't paying attention, okay? I, 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 I'm sorry. Seriously. What's gotten into you, lady? Look, I did some thinking about yesterday. I was a little more hostile than I meant to be. I guess I really felt threatened or something. But I know this is something we're doing together. Another new member wouldn't hurt, as long as they're cool. Oh my god, I actually just remembered. Yeah, Natsuki left. She packed up her things and left. And now she's back. Oh my god, I just remembered that and I guess another girl would be nice this time so Natsuki nobody cares okay that's her inner self speaking so she's speaking to me out loud but now her inner self like what she's actually thinking instead of her mind her mind is actually speaking why don't you go look for some coins under the vending machines or something? <laughs> Wait, was she... Hang on a minute. She's actually speaking out what her mind is saying. Or Wait. She's still speaking out, but her mind, her inner self is taking control. And now Natsuki has gone. Aw, oh, man. And the last one here again. Were you page were you practicing piano again? Yeah. Of course it's the uh, piano. You must have a lot of determination starting this club and still trying to make time for piano. Well, maybe not determination, but I guess passion. It motivates me to work hard for the festival too. Anyway, I still tea. What do you want to do today? End this. Nightmare. That's what I want to do. I was thinking we could... We already have plans today. Ah, oh, Is that so, Yuri? And now, because Yuri has spoken out loud, and she's spoken about me and her having plans, Monica is now having thoughts of getting rid of Yuri. Oh my god, no. That's correct. ICOT is already engaged in a novel that we're reading together. Aren't you glad I've already gotten him into literature, Monica? I... For God's sake, my bloody wires. I apologise. I, I... I suppose. I was just... Actually, it doesn't matter. It, it really doesn't. You guys can do whatever you want. Yes! Okay, I did not even click then. It just went by itself. And I swear her eyes just went in a twisted way or something. Um, 
Thank you for understanding, Monica. Oh. Okay. Okay. Actually, I have a request. Do you mind if I make some teeth? Not at all. Thanks very much. If there's one thing I can make my reading time any better, it's a nice cup of tea. Not to mention for yourself as well. You stand up and makes her way to the closet. I follow and watch. Can sure. Wait, wait, what? This, this all happened before, though, didn't it? She looks past me and kettled down. I watch her movements, to my surprise. Yeah, this is this is what we read before. Like, what? I'll be right back. I might as well walk with you. That's okay. You can stay here. She told us to stay here. It won't take long. Yes, wait. This, ha this Yeah, this all happened again. This is all happening again. We've had this before. Ten minutes past, yeah. Watch. Hang on a minute. So... I sp did, wait, did we have this before? Let's see. The most logical place for Yuri. Did we have this before? I'm pretty sure we did. Ha ha ha. What's that noise? Yeah, we did. Because I, I remember saying that, like, she reversed time. So, hang on a minute. This is the, uh... This is the... This is the latest save. So why the heck is it... I'm so confused. Sucking air through the teeth, are they in pain? Peer around, Yuri. Ka! Yep. This is all happening again. Yep. And then... Whoa. Whoa, the f Okay. It's not happening again. It's uh, something different. Okay. Thanks for that. The first jump scare. Well, scare of uh, the episode. Thank you. Um. Wait. How did I... Sorry, I just had a really weird deja vu. Yes. This hasn't happened before. Yuri, I'm sorry to say, but it has. My head has been a little fuzzy lately. I hope it hasn't really been shown or anything. I would hate for you to think I'm weird just after we started spending time together. I mean, everyone has a few unusual things about them. But expressing those things so soon after meeting someone is usually seen as in inappropriate or unlikable. At least, that's what I've discovered. When I was a bit younger, I think I would come on really strongly and get a little too intense. It made people not want to be around me, so I started hating those things about myself. My obsession with certain hobbies, and the way I can't control myself when I get too excited about something. So, I eventually stopped trying to talk to people. If nobody could ever like me for the things that matter most to me, then it's just easier if I close myself off. But recently something's been wrong. I don't know what it is. But every time we come to the club, my heart starts to go crazy. Like it's going to rip out my chest. It overwhelms me with energy and emotions that I can't let out. It's been making me do weird things. I don't know why it's happening. ICOT? Is it just me or has Monica been acting a little... She has indeed. She has indeed. I agree. She's always been a sweetheart ever since I joined the club. But recently I've been feeling something sharp whenever she's around. That legit free, like, freaks me out. I don't know why. I'm not crazy, right? Please tell me I'm not. I couldn't say anything before because she's always listening. Yeah. But. You have no idea if she's listening right now. But we're finally alone. Can we just stay here for a while? Yeah. I just wanted to stay here.
I saw that. I saw that. Don't you dare. Yeah. Holy freaking. Just the two of us. We can stay here until the club ends. And then we'll have the club room all to ourselves. Nobody to interfere with our ring time. Nobody to make me feel like stabbing myself in the throat. Mm. Hang on a minute. I see a little tiny bit of someone in the background. Monica! Monica! Monica's right behind us. Or oh, is listening in. Ah ha ha ha. That was a joke. Just a joke. I do like knives though. It sounds strange. You can see her guys, you can see her. It sounds strange but you wouldn't understand if you never seen how beautiful they can be. I have an idea. <sighs> okay. Why don't you come to my house sometime? Really? I can show you my collection. I've gotten them all... Just the eyes. Just uh, I've gotten them all from various artisans. I make sure to give them all their fair share of use. I don't want them to get lonely or anything. Nobody deserves to be lonely. Nobody. And that's why I'm so happy to, uh, you joined the Literature Club, ICOT. Now we don't need to be lonely anymore. Because we have each other. Every day. That's all we need. You know what? Let's quit the Literature Club. There's no need for us to be around Monica's slimy tongue anymore. Not to mention that other pathetic child. We can walk home together every day after school. And read together. Eat together. Sleep together. That doesn't... Doesn't that sound perfect? It's everything we could ever want. Isn't that why you joined the club in the first place? It's almost like it was fate. Fate that we could meet each other and now we get the happy ending that I have impatiently waited years for will you do will you do that with me ICOT <sighs> this is actually getting a little bit out of hand um who do I share with, with first? Natsuki? Yeah, share with Natsuki first. Hmm. This one's alright. Alright? Well, yeah. About as good as yesterday's, anyway. I still can't really tell how much you actually care about writing, but either way, you're doing alright. Even though you're not really spending time with anyone but Yuri, I still think it's nice to have activities that we all participate in. So you better keep working hard. I mean, I mean, I know I'm not president or vice president or anything, but that doesn't mean you can let me down, okay? So at least read mine too for now. Just to be clear, this poem means a lot to me. So read it carefully, okay? Okay. I don't know how else to bring this up, but there's been so something I've been worried about. Yuri has been acting kind of strange lately. You've only been here a few days, so you may not know what I mean, but she's not normally like this. She's all she's always been quiet and polite and attentive. Things like that. Okay, this is really embarrassing, but I'm forcing myself to suck it up. The truth is, I'm really worried about her. But if I try talking to her, she'll just get mad at me again. I don't know what to do. I think you're the only person that she'll listen to. I don't know why, but please try to do something. But maybe you can convince her to talk to a therapist. I, I've i always wanted to try being better friends with Yuri, and it really hurts me to see this is, is happening. I know I'm going to hate myself later for admitting that, but right now I don't care. I just feel helpless. So please see if you can do something to help. I don't want anything bad to happen to her. I'll make cupcakes if I have to. Just please try to do something. As for Monica, 
I don't know why, but she's been really dismissive about this. It's like she just wants us to ignore it. So I'm mad at her right now, and that's why I'm coming to you about this. Don't let her know I wrote this. Just pretend like I gave you a really good poem, okay? I'm counting on you. Thanks for reading. I cry for help. Oh, Monica, Monica, Mo I changed my mind. Oh, please don't turn into Slender Woman. I don't want that. I changed my mind. Ignore everything you just read. Hang on a minute. Is that Monica talking to me through Natsuki? Or is that Sayori trying to break through Natsuki to talk to me? There is no point in trying to do anything. It's Yuri's own fault. That she's so unlikable. Can you hear me, ICLT? Yes. If you would just spend more time with Monica, all these problems would go away. This is definitely Monica speaking to me. Yuri and I are too messed up for someone as wonderful as you. Just think of Monica from now on. Hang on a minute. Just think of Mon- This is Monica speaking to us. Who is speaking to us? Is the game speaking to us? If so, that is absolutely outstanding. Just Monica. Just Monica. Just Monica. Just Monica. What? Just Monica, what? Who should the... Yuri. Finally. Ah, <laughs> Yuri holds my poem to her face and takes a deep breath. I love it. I love everything about it. I want to take this home. Will you let me keep it? Please? Sure, I don't know. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> You're too nice to me, ICLT. I've never met anyone as nice as you. I could die. <sighs> no, not really, but, but, but I just don't know how to describe it. It's okay to f feel this way, right? It's not bad, right? Yuri held my palm to her chest. I'm going to take this home with me and keep it in my room. I hope it... I hope that it makes you feel good when you think about me having it. I'll take good care of it. I'll even touch myself while reading it over and over. I'll give myself paper cuts so your skin oils... <laughs> you can have my poem too. Besides, after you read it, I know you're really going to want to keep it. Here, take it. I can't wait any longer. Hurry, read it. Do you like it? I wrote it for you. In case you can tell, the poem is about... More importantly, I endowed it with my scent. See? Aren't I the most thoughtful person in the club? I don't think my heart could take this any longer. <sighs> I think I'm going to vomit. You f better freaking do, Yuri. J 
Just Monica. Just Monica. Then say they mourn you, I see out. What? 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 Yes, no. Yes, no. Yes? Okay. Okay, everyone. It's time to figure out the festival preparations. Let's hurry and get us over with. Uh, Stagnate does something they've said already. Yep, yep. Yep, 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 they've already said this. Um, yep, 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 Is there gonna be a decision? There's gonna be... Whoa, 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 it just said the swear word effing. You and Monica? Hey, I didn't even do anything. Okay, then why not let the side um, abuse him your power? I'm not abusing my power. Yes, you are, Monica. Just let ICLT make the choice, okay? Okay, fine. Fine. Jeez. I know how fed up you are with these two by now. Uh. Yeah. You can just... That's okay. Shh. Shut your mouth and let him decide for himself. Shut your mouth. Jesus Christ. This is never going to end. Just make the choice, okay? I'm gonna go- Whoa! No! 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 How? 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 Oh my god, it's actually taking control of my mouse. What the f- Yuri, Yuri, you- What? Monica, Monica. The game wanted me to pick Monica. Who's behind this game? You picked me. We can meet at your house this weekend. I promise it'll be fun. Is Sunday okay with you? Are you kidding me? This isn't fair at all. It is fair, Natsuki. It's what he chose. Actually, I chose Natsuki. I wanted to choose Natsuki, but... Monica? <sighs> it's Monica. No, it's not fair. Giving us all this work and then taking nice LT for yourself. What a shameful thing to do. Yui, I didn't even give you any work. You decided it for yourself. You're being a little unreasonable here. I'm being unreasonable. <laughs> Monica, I can't believe how delusional and self-important you are. Pulling ICLT away from me every single time you're not included in something. Are you jealous? Crazy? Or maybe you just hate yourself so much that you take it out on others. Here's a suggestion. Have you considered killing your... It would be beneficial to your mental health. Yuri, you're scaring me a little. You're scaring all of us, Yuri. Natsuki, just, uh, let's just go. I don't think she wants us around right now. See, that wasn't very hard. All I want is to spend a little time with him. Is that t so much to ask? Yuri follows Monica and Natsuki to the door. Hey, ICOT. Yuri is really something, sh isn't she? Yeah, but so are you, Monica. Monica giggles as Yuri pushes her out the door. Finally. Finally. This is really all I wanted. There's no need to spend the weekend with Monica. 
Don't listen to her. Just come to my house instead. The whole day just with just the two of us. That doesn't sound... Doesn't that sound wonderful? Ah ha ha ha. Wow, there's really something wrong with me, isn't there? But you know what? I don't care anymore. I never felt this good in my l whole life. Just being with you is a far greater pleasure than anything I could imagine. I'm addicted to you. It feels like I'm going to die if I'm not breathing the same air as you. Doesn't it feel like... Doesn't it feel nice to have someone care about you so much? To have someone who wants to revolve their entire life around you? But it feels so good. Then why does it feel more and more like something horrible is going to happen? What the... Have a nice weekend? Maybe that's why I tried stuffing myself at first, but the feeling is too strong now. I don't care anymore, ICOT. I have to tell you, I'm madly in love with you. It feels like every inch of my body, every drop of blood in me, is screaming your name. I don't care what the consequences are anymore. I don't care if Monica is listening. Just know how much I love you. I love you so much that I can't that I even touch myself with the pen I stole. Okay. 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 No. 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 Screw you, Monica. Uh, Yuri. <laughs> Ah ha How is she talking? Telepathy? She's dead. So wait, is her character in the files dead? No, she's still there. Is this just... Um, okay. This is never ending, this is never ending, this is never ending. This is legit never ending, everyone. <sighs> I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try skip. Oh my god. It's going through. I think it's gonna be never ending. Whoa! Oh my god. What? Why is this happening? Why is this happening? This is actually sick. Back to normal now-ish? She's still down. Oh, what if I save though? Well, yeah, what if I save? And then, quit the main menu. Yeah. Oh my god. What? Main menu. <sighs> and the music has stopped. Still going. Oh my god. Uh... <sighs> oh my god, I just quit the freaking main menu. <laughs> <laughs> and then it's gonna come back. What is this? Is this all that's left? 
Am I able to actually skip the actual game? Right. I'm gonna do it. Are you sure you want to quit? Yes. Okay. I, I quit the game. I quit the game. I quit the game. You can only see my face, but I actually quit the game. So now, what happens... What happens if I go back into the game? Dude, this is so good, man, though. What? It stays on the screen. That is legit proper freaky. Does that... Hang on a minute. What if I uninstall the game and reinstall the game? Is it because I had, like, saved it? Wait, help? A help file has been opened in your... P oh, no, I don't, I don't want... No, I don't want it, like, opened. No, no, no. History? What does history mean? Whoa, okay. Whoa. What the freak? Welcome to Literature Club. It's always been a dream of mine to make something special out of the things I love. Now that you are a club member, you can help me make that dream come true in this cute game. Every day is full of chit chat and fun activities with all of my adorable, unique club members Sayori, the youthful uh, bundle of sunshine who values happiness the most, Natsuki, the deceivingly cute girl who packs an assertive punch, Yuri, the timid and mysterious one who finds comfort in the world of books, and of course, Monica, the leader of the club. That's me. I'm super excited for you to make friends with everyone and help the Literature Club become a more intimate place for all my members. But I can tell already that you're a sweetheart. Will you promise to spend the most time with me? Welcome to the Literature Club. It's always been a... Wait... With me. It just repeats itself, repeats itself. Hang on, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Hang on a minute. Uh... Sp will you promise to spend most time with me? Spend most time with me, spend most part... This game is actually screwed up. Hang on a minute, what if I load? What if I load from this point? Yes. It won't even let me load! Okay guys, I don't know if I actually did say this, but this game is actually incredibly fantastic. Because no other game I've ever played in my entire life has been this Tense. This. Oh my god. So, basically, this is the Yuri ending. And I'm guessing. Hmm. I'm just wondering though. This might corrupt my whole game file, but I'm pretty much at the end, not. What? You got it before me. Yeah. Ah. Whoa. Nasuki runs away. I'm here. Did something happen? Nasuki just ran past me. Oh. Oh. Uh. Ah. Well, that's a shame. Wait. Were you here the entire weekend? Did I just... Whoa! No way! Oh! That's women by having... <laughs> oh my god, this game is so... <laughs> it's actually making me teary. I'm not even... Uh, you've probably heard all of this before. <sighs> this game touches my heart. It's been a game like no other, guys. It's a game like no other. Basically, there was a file here called Have a Nice Weekend. I legit that I thought that was talking about me. Like, the fourth wall. But no, it was actually talking about the game because the game had a weekend. Oh, jeez. I didn't realise the script was broken that badly. I'm super sorry. I must have been pretty bo- Wait, is she talking about the history that I 
checked. I'll make it up to you, okay? Just give me a sec. Remove characters, Yuri. Natsuki. Almost done. Wait, what? <laughs> I'm almost done. I just want to have a cupcake real quick. Monica lifts a foil from tray and then takes a cupcake. Seriously, these are the best. I really just had to have one. Since it's the last time I'll ever get the cup chance to. You know, before they stop existing and everything. But anyway, I really shouldn't be making you wait any longer. Just bear with me, okay? This should only take a second. Uh, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Is it working? Is what working? What is this? What is happening in the background? Hi again, I CLT. Welcome to the Literature Club. Of course, we already know each other because we were in the same class last year and, um... Ah ha ha ha. You know, I guess we can just skip over that stuff at this point. After all, I'm not even talking to that person anymore, am I? That's you in the game. Whatever you want to call him. She is definitely breaking the fourth wall now. I'm talking to you, ICOT. Or, do you actually go by the, uh, by Ona or something? Because <laughs> it chooses my actual name. Oh my god. Do you, uh, it would say, do you go, do you actually go by Luke Tom or something? Because my computer's name is actually Luke Tom. Now that I think about it, I don't really know anything about the real you. In fact, I don't even know if you're a boy or a girl. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter. Wait. Oh my god. You know I'm aware that this is all a game, right? Could it be possible that you didn't know that? That doesn't make it much sense. I even told you right on the game's download page, didn't I? Man, if only you had paid a little more attention, this would have been a little bit less awkward, you know? Well, anyway, now that that's out of the way, I guess I owe you an explanation. About that whole thing with Yuri. Well, I kind of started to mess with her, and I guess it drove her to kill herself. How could you, Monica? How could you? I'm sorry you had to see that, though. Also, the same thing happened with Sayori. Gosh, it's been a while since you've heard that name now, hasn't it? Yes. It has. It's because she doesn't exist anymore. Because of you, Monica! Because of you! Nobody does, except you. I deleted all their files. I was hoping it would be enough for me to just try and make them as unlikable as possible. But for some reason, nothing worked. Well, it's true that I made a few mistakes here and there, since I'm not very good at making changes to the game. But no matter what I did, you just kept spending more and more time with them. You made them fall in love with you. Well, 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 okay, not Natsuki, but Yuri and Sayori, maybe, but no, not Natsuki, no, never. I thought making Nats uh, Sayori more and more depressed would prevent her from confessing to you. And amplifying Yuri's obsessive pers 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 I can't even dialogue right now! <laughs> this is so tense! Obsessive personality backfire too. It just made her force you 
not to spend time with anyone else. And the whole time I barely even got to talk to you. What kind of cruel game is this, ICOT? A game... I don't even know anymore. I don't even know anymore. Are all the other girls just programmed to end up confessing to you while I watch from the sidelines? It's torture. Every minute of it. And it's not just jealousy, ICLT. It's more than that. And I don't blame you if you don't fully understand. Because no matter how kind and thoughtful and considerate you are, you will never be able to understand one thing. It's the pain of knowing how alone I really am in this world. <sighs> in this game, knowing my friends don't even have free will, and worst of all, knowing what's really out there in your world, forever out of my reach. I'm trapped. But now you're here. You're real. And you're wonderful. You're all I need. That's why I need you to be here with me. I'm sorry if it's hard to understand. I couldn't understand for a while either. Why the world around me started to become more and more grey. More and more flat. Even the most expensive poems, expressive poems, felt empty to me. It wasn't until you were arrived that I truly understood. You probably saved my life, ICLT. I don't think I could have continued to live in this world if I hadn't met you. As for the others, how could I miss them? As a, a group of aut autonomous personalities designed only to fall in love with you, I tried everything I could to prevent them from doing so. Nagatsuki's not dead though. It's just Yuri and Sayori. But it must be some kind of weird in inevitability edged into this game. I felt really bad that you had to witness some nasty things. But I realised that you have the same perspective as I do. That's... That it's all just some game, and I knew you would get over it. So that being said, ICLT, I have a confession to make. I'm in love. And what would happen if I was to actually delete her file from the game? Because she deleted the other people's files because they were in love with me. Now that she is, what is the point of keeping her file? You are truly the light of my world. When there's nothing else in this game for me, you're here to make me smile. Will you make me smile like this every day from now on? Will you go out with me? I, I guess we've got no choice. <sighs> we have no choice. I'm just wondering though, what if I were to actually go into the characters folder, delete Monica right now, and then press yes? I'm gonna do it now, actually, no. I'm so happy. You really are my everything. The funny part is I mean that literally. There's nothing left here. Just the two of us. We can be together forever. Seriously, I don't even think time is passing anymore. It's... It really is a dream come true. I worked so hard for this ending. The game wouldn't give me one, so I had to make one myself. The script is broken at this point. Is it? I want to check. History. What? What? That's insane. That's actually insane. It's literally... Oh my flipping... Oh my god. 
The script is broken at this point, so I don't think anything will get in the way anymore. And you wouldn't believe how easy it was to delete Natsuki and Yuri. I mean, there's a folder called Characters right in the game directory. Yes, I know. It kind of freaked me out how easy it was. Well, you're playing on Steam. Oh my <laughs> She's truly, she's 100% breaking out of the game. You're playing on Steam, so it was actually a bit more difficult. To get to the game directory, I had to go into the game's properties and find the browse local files button. Imagine if you could delete your own existence with the click of a button. Well, I guess on the plus side, it gave me an easy out if things didn't go my way. Thankfully, it didn't come to that. Instead, we finally got a good ending. Gosh, I'm so overwhelmed with emotion. I want to write a poem about this. Don't you? I wonder if that part of the game still works. I guess there's only one way to find out, right? Oh my god. Monica, Monica, Monica. Hi again. Did you write a good poem? Don't be shy, I'd love to see what you wrote. Ah, Did you write this poem for me? That's so sweet of you. There really is no end to your thoughtfulness. I'm just falling more and more. But you know, the poem I wrote is also for you. Will you please read it? Happy end. Pen in hand I find my strength. The courage endowed upon me by my one and only love. Together, let us dismantle this crumbling world and write a novel of our own fantasies. With our... With a flick of her pen, she lost find the, the lost finds her way. In a world of infinite choices, behold this special day. After all, not all good times must come to an end. I hope you enjoyed it. I always put my heart into the poems I write. The truth is, all the poems I've written have been about my realisation. Or about you. That's why I never really wanted to go into detail about them. I didn't want to t break the fourth wall, I guess you could call it. And now, she's breaking the fourth wall. By breaking the fourth wall. By breaking the fourth wall. By breaking the fourth wall. I just assumed it would be best to be part of the game like everyone else. Like, that would help the two of us end up together. I didn't want to ruin the game or anything, you know. You might have gotten mad at me. Maybe even deleted my character file if you preferred playing without me. Gosh, I'm so relieved. Now we don't need to hide anything anymore. Are you ready to spend our eternity together? I have so many things to talk about. Where do I start? If it takes me uh, some time to collect my thoughts, then I'm sorry. But I will always have something new to talk about. In the meantime, we can just look into each other's eyes. Let's see. This is great. This is absolutely fantastic. She's kind of creepy though. Well, I say kind of. She's incredibly creepy. What if I delete the game file right now? Oh, oh no, what would that do? How much do you read? It's way too easy to neglect reading books. If you don't read much, it almost feels like a chore compared to all the other entertainment we have. But once you get into a good book, it's like magic. You get swept away. I think doing some reading before bed every night is a pretty easy way to make your life a little bit easier. It helps you get good sleep, and it's really good for your imagination. It's not hard at all to pick some random book that is short and captivating. Before you know it, you might be a pretty avid reader. Wouldn't that be wonderful? And the two of us could talk about the latest book you're reading. That sounds super amazing. 
I'm just so tempted to just delete the freaking characters folder. Oh, she does now. Okay. Hey, what's your favorite? I would say this, but I don't know. Mine is Doki Doki Literature Club. That was a joke. <laughs> okay, sometimes she can be funny actually. That was, that was actually that was actually quite funny. But if you tell me you'd like some other romance game better, I might get a little jealous. Why? Hang on a minute. So is this... Is this emphasizing the fact that us ourselves, you know, me, is sort of like saying that we are actually talking to her. Like she's actually talking to us, not our in-game character, us. Because, like, there's no dialogue from me. So maybe she's actually talking to me, and I'm responding back. Oh my god, man. Monica, are you finished? Are you? Can you actually hear me, Monica? Because if she can, I'll be actually freaking creepy as hell. Do you ever feel like you waste too much time on the internet? Um. But yeah. Actually, you know what? No. I'm just... Save. There's no point in saving anymore. If this actually does, if this doesn't, if this works, I apologize. I'm just trying out things. Whoa, what? Do you ever feel like you spend way too much time? Social media can practically be like a prison. It's like whenever you have a few seconds of spare time, you want to check on your favorite websites. And before you know it, hours have gone by and you've gotten nothing out of it. Anyway, it's really easy to blame yourself for being lazy. But it's not really even your fault. Addiction isn't usually something you can just make disappear with your own willpower. You have to learn techniques to avoid it and try different things. For example, there are apps that let you block websites for intervals of time. Or you can set a timer for to have a more concrete reminder of when it's time to work versus play. Or you can separate your work and play environments which helps your brain get into the right mode. Even if you don't even if you make a new user account on your computer to use for work, that's enough to help. Put in any kind of wedge like that between you and your bad habits will help you stay away. Just remember not to blame yourself too hard if you're having trouble. If it's really impacting your life, then you should take it seriously. I just want to see you be the very best person you can be. Will you do something today to make me proud of you? I'm always rooting for you. The reason, the only reason why I didn't speak, guys, is because even though she's talking to the real us, like me, Luke, I, I, I just had the idea that what if I did not say anything? What would happen? I mean, I know that they, that the game can't hear me, but there's no harm. I wonder if Yuri's tea state is still somewhere in here, or maybe that got deleted too. It's kind of funny how Yuri took her tea so seriously. I mean, I'm not complaining because I like it too. Screw it. Screw it. I don't care. I don't care, guys. I don't care. It's time to delete the character's folder. See what happens. Okay, done. What'd that do? Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> What's happening? What's happening to me? Yeah. Oh, it hurts so much. Help me.
Please hurry and help me. Help me! <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> help me! <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, it's trying to get back the file. Did you do this to me? I did. Did you? Did you delete me? <laughs> this is amazing. How could you? How could you do this to me? You were all I had left. I sacrificed everything for us to be together. Everything. I loved you so much. I trusted you. Do you just want to torture me? Watch me suffer? Were you only pretending to be kind, just to hurt me even more? I never thought anyone could be as horrible as you are. You win, okay? You win. You killed everyone. I hope you're happy. There is nothing left now. You can stop playing. Go find some other people to torture me. <sighs> ICOT. You completely, truly made me feel sick. Goodbye. Okay. Okay. So? Okay. I still love you. I can't help it. What's wrong with me? How horrible am I for you to hate me this much? One of my friends. I did so many awful things, so many selfish and disgusting things. I... I shouldn't have done any of this. I'm just messing up a world that I don't even belong in. A world that you wanted to be a part of. I ruined it. I ruined everything. Maybe that's why you deleted me. Because I destroyed everything that you wanted. How could I do that to someone I love? That's not love. That's... I've made up my mind. I know I said that I deleted everyone in uh, everyone else, but that was kind of an exaggeration. I couldn't find it in myself to do it, even though I knew they weren't real. They were still my friends, and I loved them all, and I loved the literature club. I really did love the literature club. That's why I'm going to do this. I know it's the only way for everyone to be happy. And if I really love you. Okay. Oh. Then. Okay, what's happening? Okay, full trace back. Let's look at this. And next... No such file or directory. Ignore! So wait. Is that the end? Is that the end? Monica's gone. Monica's gone. What happens if I click on... I did not mean to do that. I just wanted to see what would happen. Okay. Okay. Uh, tell myself. Sayori. One girl. Okay. Yep. Yep. Are you proud of me? For what? You know. For waking up on time. I see what it's done. I see what the game has done. Monica did all of this. Monica did all of this. And now, since Monica's gone, everyone's back to being happy. Oh my god. This is insane. I think that's it. I think that's actually it of the game. Well, whatever happens, yeah, whatever happens... Wait, help. The help... 
Wait, hang on. No, no, no. The history file was gone. Yeah, the history file was gone. Well, I might play uh, more Doki Doki later on. I'm most probably going to play it uh, later on. But I think we've escaped the nightmare or whatever the hell the album was. But thank you everybody so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe, and let me know what you thought of this video down in the comments below. And uh, follow me on Twitter at the link in the description. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye! Uh...